The following video is not a joke because this video is about ISIS. See, last year I heard about a city that was attacked by ISIS. I was in the area, so I went up close to see it. The location doesn't matter, but the visuals do. Because ISIS has destroyed the city. I saw army checkpoints. I saw bulletproof vests, bomb destruction, airstrikes. I saw bullet shells, people who lost their homes, and even live gunfire. Dude, this is not safe. Holy shit. Between the army and ISIS terrorists. This is an actual war zone. You may think all of this happened in Syria or Iraq or the Middle East where ISIS started, but it didn't. This happened 5,000 miles away in a small town in southern Philippines called Marawi. And that's what shocked me the most. It wasn't the destruction, it was the reach of ISIS. How did they get so far? How did they destroy this peaceful village? Then I realized ISIS is not a person. It's an ideology. Anyone can have it anywhere. Here, 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 or here. It may even be your neighbor. That's why killing a terrorist is easy, but killing an ideology is hard. And I think that's exactly what the locals were trying to do. Five miles away from the destruction, I saw a university that was open. Education, they said, is the best way to kill an ideology. We are going to open our classes uh, by August 21 uh, because we are very confident that uh, we are in a peaceful uh, situation. Women and men attended university even when bombs were falling in the background. Everyone disapproved of ISIS. Everyone wanted the war to end. And they did. Five months later, the Philippines army, with the help of the US army, was able to liberate the city. This unique experience I do not recommend or wish to anyone. But it was a learning experience. It taught me that extremism is not just ISIS and not just Muslims. Anyone can become an extremist in any religion, in any country. We must fight it anywhere we see it, just like they did. Let's kill extremism before it kills us. See you next week. Hey there, how are you? Thank you so much for watching the video. Try watching another video. They're short and they're meaningful. Also, try following this channel. I think you'll enjoy it. Every day, there's gonna be a much better video coming your way. Thank you so much.